Hi, criminal justice students. This is Jane from the SC4 Library. And this first little segment, I'm going to show you how to get to the SC4 Library homepage and some uh, information that's available on the library homepage. So the easiest way to get there, you can just Google SC4 Library. And it's usually the first thing that comes up. Click on it, it looks like this. You can also get there by typing sc4.edu slash library, get to the same spot. We have a one search box that searches all 200 of our library databases. And our library databases have full text ebooks in them, uh, journal articles, newspaper articles, academic videos, and uh, they're grouped. You can search like a certain area, like if you just want an ebook or a print book, or if you want a peer reviewed or scholarly journal article. So once you search it, you can narrow down your search results. And that's in a different video. If you wanted to search the databases individually, all 200 are listed alphabetically in under databases A to Z. And there's a great criminal justice database called Criminal Justice Periodicals, which I'll talk about a little bit more. Our hours are over here on the right. Uh, you can click here to view hours like for the coming month. Uh, we're closed, you know, over Christmas time and so on. So if you wanted to know our hours um, for the next month or two months, you can click there. Multiple ways to contact us at the reference desk. You can click on contact the library and you can text us, email us, call us, stop in when we're open. And we have a 24 seven live chat with the librarian. So let's say in the chat box is also down here. Let's say it's Sunday night or um, over the holiday and you need to contact a reference librarian, you can type in your question in this chat box. It's covered by um, over academic librarians at over 400 colleges and universities across the country and Great Britain. So you may not be chatting with an SC4 reference librarian, especially if you're on the weekend or late at night, um, but it's an academic librarian. They'll have access to our library homepage and they should be able to get you started on your research. Okay, sometimes you come across an article that we don't have. As a current student, you can request the article through interlibrary loan. So you just click right here. Or if you're having trouble, like you pull up an article, but you can't seem to get to the full text, just fill out this interlibrary loan form because we'll look for it for you. We usually receive articles within three days. So, and we email it directly to you. So it's a very fast way of finding and gathering full text information. In the left-hand column, the library is open, but if you feel more comfortable doing a curbside pickup, we still provide curbside pickup. So you just click here, put in the title of a print book that you wanna see. And we, on the form, it says to give us 24 hours, but we usually get them ready as long as we're open. We get them ready within an hour or two. Uh, we have three study rooms that are available that you can reserve if you want to meet in a group. You just click here to reserve a study room. You can do this right from home on or off campus. And then we have research guides. These are very helpful for finding um, information. And there is a research guide for criminal justice. So they are arranged by general topic area. And then there's a complete alphabetic listing of all the guides. So if we scroll down to criminal justice, um, we go right to that guide. And I'll talk about that in a separate video. Um, but you can also find this criminal justice guide by typing in, in Google, SC4 space library space CJ, and you usually get right to this criminal justice. Thank you.